of good sources brought to us by site <laughs> site effective by design.org which is super easy for you guys to get to and i do want to give them a little bit of a shout out because they are awesome and there's a whole bunch of information that you guys can get off their site as well but under the title brick nintendo before they brick you we get another riveting tale of companies taking their terms and conditions a bit too far so the website specializes in finding companies that use their drm or digital rights management to restrict how a person can use this product that they just bought most of this is done to protect the creators of said content from copyright infringements but sometimes things can get downright nasty for the users itself which is like me and you so I want you guys to, you know, learn together with me today um, what <laughs> Nintendo has been up to with their terms of service. And it's a lot, apparently, and I was taken a little aback by some of the things that are on here. So once you have accepted the Nintendo's 3D terms of service, they basically have access to every game that you've ever played along with any information or any data that's ever been put on your device, ever. And I mean anything that is on your device. So personal data such as your name, your address, if you entered your age, your gender, your location status, your serial number on your actual device that you're using, uh, wireless access info from, you know, your like your Wi-Fi and your internet, your IP address, media access address, and literally any comment, message, photo you take, movies, whatever other information may be on your device actually belongs to them and their servers. So you definitely heard me right on that. Nintendo owns the photos that you take on your 3DS and, um, you know, to do with what they please. So those sweet pics that you take on your 3DS or any Nintendo product belongs to Nintendo the moment you press capture. Not to mention they've taken the Apple and the Google route of selling your information to third parties so advertisers can better quote unquote suit you. And if the title of the article didn't tip you off, Nintendo has also has the right to also brick your system anytime, anywhere at their leisure. Or in other words, Nintendo has claimed the right to use the information they collect from your device to judge if you are allowed to even continue using it. So that was a lot of fun. <laughs> Thanks, Nintendo.